Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. Today we are in the garage. Um, because I want to show you a few things that we did out here. Some of you are not, it might not be cool. Some of you, probably pretty cool. Um, so, yeah. Um, first of all, my dad got this flag. It's uh, the flag of the heroes of, um, well, I mean, you can read it. Um, it's just the names of the people who, uh, ended up losing their lives, um, in the 9-11 attack, um, or attacks, um, all the stripes, it's just names upon names upon names. I'll be honest, I didn't know that many people died. Yeah. So that's what they're teaching us in history class. So, yeah, um... Dad left, we got the garage cleared out, and holy cow, I just realized this. There's some stuff, like, right here on the lens. How's that? A bit better? Kind of. How's that? Oh, perfect. Anyway, so, we got the car here. <clears throat> As you can see, it's very salty, like. Very, very salty. My, my finger's dirty now. <clears throat> so, oh yeah, okay, so. I did one strip right here. Check out the difference. Look at that. Look at that difference. There are some streaks here just because it got quite salty. Not salty like mad, but like salty like, like this stuff. But look at that. Look at that difference. You can see it all the way up. So I did the back here. Um, the water ended up being like straight black by the time I was done. Did the roof. Um, still kind of patchy, you know, but that's okay. It's okay. Um, but yeah, that's all that I've done so far. I kind of wanted to bring you guys along so you can see how, uh, how this is going. Um, and uh, yeah, so. Um, kick off a uh, little time lapse and uh, see how far I get on the side of the car here. So, let's go do that. So guys, as you just saw on the left, I'm gonna get copyrighted by that. Anyway, um, so as I showed you on the other side, I was leaving like the salt marks if I like used the uh, the brush for too long on it without wringing it out in the water. Um, you know, stuff like this happens. Like, like that, there's still salt residue on there. And you know, you can see it in a few other spots, you know, down there, up here. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's a huge improvement from this. But yes, it does look like I did just clean it. And then not really care about what it looked like afterward. So, I'm going to try. I have a few um, microfiber towels downstairs. I'm going to go get some of those. And see if after I wipe it, or you know, wash it off with the, with the sponge. Um, if I can just like wipe that off. And it will get rid of the rest of the salt residue. 
if so I'm gonna kind of redo my car um, so I'm gonna go get those towels and let's see here I don't even know where I put those no it's somewhere in here I'll find it found one so um, yeah that's kind of my plan not entirely sure if it's gonna work work out but like with um with this back windshield this was probably one of the worst areas it it looks like this just on glass um probably got a little bit up here on my wind yeah yep it was like this just a lot worse um it was probably the yeah it, that's probably about accurate if you take that right there and put it all over that that's pretty much how it was so yeah um but like here i was going like halfway over um with like a half brush or a half sponge length so you know i'd go like here and then i'd you know probably get like to there and then i'd stop and then i'd take half half it go over again and then stop and wring it out so you know yeah that's what it should look like by the way so yeah so I'm just gonna do this quick. Just kind of leave that over there. See if I do see a difference. Um, and we'll just kind of make a line. There we go. Okay. Toss that in there. Towel. Ugh. It's hard to wipe and film at the same time if you haven't noticed. It's hard to dry and film at the same time. Ugh. Microfiber towels don't really absorb water too well, by the way. Mm. But they are very nice on uh, the glass. So, yeah, I think that's going to be my new way. Yeah, that worked really well. Yeah, this spot here is still a little wet. There, yeah, yeah, that looks a lot better. Okay, that's gonna be my new way. Obviously, it's still wet in some spots there, but I'm gonna try this out on the rest of the car and uh, see if I can get rid of stuff like that. So, yeah, we'll be back and uh, we'll be back. Out again. Hashtag copyright. Anyway, um, it's all dry now, as you can see. Um, um, I mean, it it looks real good. It looks like it does in the summer. Um, back windshield here still looks kind of spotty, but yeah, I'll clean it up here in a minute. But I mean, it looks great. Now I just gotta kind of do the rest of this. So, yeah. Um, let's jump in.
Um, so far, so good. Water is again black. Uh, but overall, you can see where I kind of stopped right by the uh, the door jam there. Overall, really good. Um, now, we just got to get this back side here a little bit. And this side too. And uh, this. So I've done like a quarter of the car. Okay. Um, and I didn't check the time when I just went to pause my music here, but it is currently 6.20. I've been at this for 35, 40 minutes already. So yeah. Okay, now I think I got the majority of the car done. Um, off camera, I did like from here-ish down. Then what you guys just saw from in there, um, I did the windshield and the hood here. Um, and then again, off camera, same time I did this area, I did all through here, which was quite hard because most of the salt was collected like right on these, uh, these boards down here. So, yeah. Um, I think she's coming out pretty good. What do you guys think? Leave your comments down below if you have any suggestions for the next time I do this in about two months. Um, I'll, uh, I'll make a part two to this and I'll, I'll use your guys' suggestions. So now all we got left to do is this side of the car. Um, except for, uh, well, from about there up. We don't need to do that because I already did it. And yeah. So, time lapse. Okay, it's working now so it didn't my camera didn't record any of it because it's, it's uh, uh yeah you got it anyway um I just finished up this last part of the car apparently my memory card was locked so it didn't record anything but 
It's looking pretty good. I think it looks good. Um, so, yeah. Um, car's all washed. But there is something that I want to show you at uh, the end of the street. And uh, this next clip that I show you guys after the clean car montage, um, it's uh, it's very. Um, you could take it many different ways. One of those ways being the sexual way, um, which I know most of you will take it that way. Um, so don't don't take it that way. Okay. Thank you. Um, so yeah, we'll. Welcome back. I'm currently on the tractor here, as you can see. Uh, and right in front of me now is something that's been erected in two days. Two days this thing has been built. So, here it is, guys. Here's our pole barn. It's made out of poles. Um, it doesn't have a roof yet, so we're going to start storing stuff under here and we're not going to have a roof. So, yeah. Awesome. Not sure if I'm technically allowed to go in here. I mean, it's ours, but I'm not sure if it's, you know, 100% safe. But I'm not sure they would actually leave this like this if uh, if it wasn't. So, yeah, I'm sure it's fine. Yeah, this is quite big, actually. I think it's 42 by 42. I'm pretty sure. Don't quote me on that, though. That's. Those are just the numbers that I remember. But yeah, now we got a pole barn. Um, so yeah, I think it's a 10 foot door. Um, I'm not sure how wide it is, but yeah, we're gonna have a door there. And then a little service door over there. So yeah, awesome. Yeah, that's, that's just the update. I just, yeah, that's it, pretty much. Um, this is where I'm gonna end the vlog, guys. Um, yeah, just comment down below what you guys think. I should do for the next video when I clean my car. Uh, we're not the next video, but the next time I clean my car. So, uh, yeah. Like and subscribe. So that's what vlogs. Always vlog. Um, remember guys, you only have one life to live. So live life to its fullest. We'll see you guys in the next vlog.